more muscular new 2018 Bentley Continental GT shapes up. Exclusive images show new look for Bentley Continental GT, which will have more power and stronger efficiency when released in 2018. The Bentley Continental GT has been around for 13 years and despite a wealth of updates since it arrived, its basic look, technology, and architecture have remained untouched. That is all about to change, with a more powerful, fuel-efficient, and luxurious next-generation model that Bentley is finalizing for a debut in 2018. The McLaren 570 GT, Aston Martin DB11 and Mercedes-AMG S63 Coupe were merely drawings in a designer's sketchpad while the current Continental was flying out of showrooms. But the increased competition means Bentley has had to dramatically up its game with the all-new model, shown here in our spy shots and exclusive images. Key to the overhaul is redesigned chassis technology that will underpin the two-door coupe. The MSB platform, first used on the new Porsche Panamera, is considerably lighter than the architecture from the current Continental. It's likely that this GT will shed around 150 kilograms, thanks to the new aluminium body, fresh chassis, and new engines. Flagship models will come powered by a new 600 bhp 6.0 liter W12 that first appeared in the Bentayga SUV, while a redeveloped version of the more modest 4.0 liter twin turbo V8 will also be offered. Bentley CEO Wolfgang Duerheimer has also previously expressed an interest in a plug-in hybrid version of the new Continental, which is expected to adopt the powertrain from the Panamera e-hybrid a mix of a twin-turbo 2.9-liter V6 and electric motor, for a combined output of 455 bhp. Bentley has the option of introducing a diesel Continental for the first time, too. The 4.0-liter twin-turbo V8 diesel also from the Bentayga could address a common gripe with current buyers, who are frustrated not by the cost of refills, but by the inconvenience of visits to the pumps. The spy shots show that the coupe will take cues from the EXP 10 Speed 6 concept that appeared at the Geneva Motor Show last year. That model will make it into production as a two-seater sports car expected to be called the Barnato while the Continental will remain a more practical 2 plus 2. A lower nose, more sculpted bonnet and new two-part LED headlamps will make up the bulk of the changes at the front, plus Bentley's trademark rear haunches and cascading roofline can also be picked out in the images. While the Continental GT will arrive first, the drop-top GTC which has been spied alongside the coupe development testing will follow shortly after, with the same visual and technology changes. As with the current model, it will stick with a folding fabric roof to help keep weight down. The range will then expand further with the addition of a new flying spur saloon. Bentley's product offensive, initiated by the Bentayga SUV, is part of Durheimer's plan to increase annual global sales to around 20,000 units by 2020.